Lunch with Lombardi, special location today, top of Chinese Peak in the Sierra Nevada, China Peak Ski Resort. Behind me, that's Huntington Lake, frozen over for what, maybe a couple more weeks, but spring is almost here, and that means the football season is a little bit closer, and also obviously the tampering period and free agency, that's starting in just a couple days. The lunch part of this is coming right after this football discussion of this video. They got good pizza here halfway down at China Peak. So I got to ski down first, then I got to edit the video, then you'll get to see the pizza. But for now, we're going to talk about Deshaun Watson and how that might complicate the Jimmy Garoppolo trade market or how that might simplify the Jimmy Garoppolo trade market. I think it's going to do a little bit of both because with Garoppolo and a potential trade, we had always talked about the Aaron Rodgers domino needing to fall because obviously a quarterback needy team is going to be looking for Aaron Rodgers first. Well, the Aaron Rodgers domino fell when he re-signed with Green Bay. Now we wait for Jimmy Garoppolo, but now Deshaun Watson will not receive any criminal indictment from the grand jury. That means that teams are going to be interested in trading with the Texans for him. That's similar to Aaron Rodgers. The Watson domino must fall before the 49ers are able to trade Jimmy Garoppolo in all reasonable estimation. Something crazy might happen, but just given the way supply and demand in the market works, I would expect Watson to need to be traded from the Texans before the 49ers find a trade partner for Garoppolo. So onto the pizza, it's actually legit here, as you can tell. Yes, I'm a bacon and pineapple guy on the pizza. I don't care what you think, but we're gonna give it a try. Then we're gonna get back on to talking some football and skiing. Tiger.